Y'all don't know who the fuck I am, do you? Warm Comics, welcome the creator of Sorted Lives, Mr. Del Show. Grew up in Winters, Texas, where Sorted Live is set, and we had no Jews. We were Jewless. Not, not a. I'm serious. Not a single Jew. I thought Jew was a verb until I was 17 years old. We, we were born with that shit. I mean, it is ingrained in us. We were like all this bigotry, this prejudice. It's like. You have, to, you have to rewire yourself. You have to reprogram. I, I use haggle now. <laughs> it takes a while, right? Haggle, it's a, a way from, yes, Jew verb haggle. Early in my career, I had this, um, this Jewish agent, um, Jewish, I said Jewish, uh, named uh, Jackie Goldberg. She calls me up and she goes, Dell, Listen, honey, this is Jackie. I need, I, I've got an appointment for you tomorrow. It's with Michael Levy over at Universal. Hold on just a second. God damn it, Howard, just fax the fucking thing. <laughs> All right, honey, I'm back. <laughs> Listen, it's at 100 Universal Plaza Drive in just a second, darling. Just put the fucking thing, just push send. This is a hairdresser who's in shock a over my hair, but he's been very good. Anyway, what were you going to say, Dale? Well, I was wondering if they could do your hair. No, I'm okay. <laughs> My Aunt Sissy met me at the door, and she said, Delford? That's my real name. D-E-L-F-E-R-D. Delford. Can, can you imagine looking at a baby? Delford. The best I can do is Delford. Judge Reinhold, do y'all know the actor Judge Reinhold? Yeah, he played Harmony in my movie. I worked with him twice. The biggest fucking asshole I've ever worked with. Just a complete and utter jerk. All right, that was just a pun. Is he here tonight? Because I know he's not working. <laughs> Nicolette Sheridan is dumb as rocks. Randy Harrison, who plays Justin, or play Justin on Queer as Folk, he is an ungrateful little shit. Someone who is not, who is not an asshole, is Rue McClanahan. Rue lives here in New York, but she was in LA doing a movie. And I said, Rue, listen, I, we have this great opportunity to get some publicity for the show. And she goes, uh, well, well, come on, we need it, come on, we need it, what is it? I said, we have the opportunity to have lunch with Perez Hilton. She said, oh, honey, I don't like Paris Hilton. <laughs> what are we gonna talk about? I said, no, 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 not Paris Hilton, Perez Hilton. And you know, Rue, Rue has email, but someone else reads it for her and answers it. So the internet, the, the, so I'm trying to explain the name and what a blogger is. She's not getting any of it. Okay, what she did get was that nine million people read Perez every day. And Rue understands show business. And she said, let's do it. And so Rue and I arrive, and Jason has already texted all the paparazzi for us. And we walk in, and there's a little bit of a stir. There's some paparazzi building outside. We sit at this table. And this waitress comes over. <gasps> Miss McClanahan. Oh my god, I love you. I'm not supposed to do this. I'm you are the reason that I act. <laughs> a lot of times actors and, and waiters are, you know, the same in LA. I don't know if it's the same here in, in New York, but uh, thank you, Caroline. <laughs> she said, when I was a little girl, the Golden Girls came on and I wanted to be Blanche Devereaux. And Rue goes, so you wanted to be a tramp. <laughs> So we all laugh, you know, and it's good. And then she goes, my only regret is that I never got to see you in Wicked. I couldn't afford to go to New York to see you. So I saw Carol Kane and she was okay, but I can just imagine how great you are. Rue goes, thank you so much, honey. That means so much. Now listen, we're gonna have lunch with this blogger. Dale, what that, what's his name? Uh, Perez, oh yeah, Perez Hilton. When he gets here, could you do that again? 